Yo, 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 it's me, and I'm back with a brand new video. Now, I always wonder um, how I should start this video. Should I be going more Mr. Beast vibes and be like, Hey, what's up? It's me. Today we're doing a live painting. Because I've heard that the algorithm does promote a lot of noise um, in the start of your video. So I don't know if that's the way to go about it. But I think this video will take it more chilled. And um, yeah, let me take you step by step of what I was thinking while I created this painting called The Lazy Priest. One of the first things that I always do when I'm starting a new painting is just measure out the dimensions. Um, in a previous exhibition that I had, somebody commented that my work is almost mathematical. And that almost motivated me to continue going on that path because I quite like that scientific sense to my work, although I didn't think it was that fashion in the past. So the next thing you'll see me do is uh, paint over and over and over. Now the reason being is I paint primarily on 3mm superwood panels and they don't absorb paint as well as a canvas would. So sometimes I'm stuck there for hours painting over and over the same thing. Uh, it does become quite tedious at some point, but uh, at the end of the day when you see the product, it's worth it when the work is flush, clean. Um, that is one of the most satisfying things that you can achieve, on one of these paintings at least. So here you see me doing some of the more finer details, which are the teeth. Many, many times these things annoy me. I wish that um, fine art or painting worked as the same it would work in digital painting, where I could just drop and pick up and drop a color down onto the canvas, but unfortunately it's not that easy. Um, but I do also think that's one of the reasons why you enjoy painting, because it's such a long and tedious process that when you eventually achieve something that looks like something, uh, you know the man hours and the, the effort that went into it. So something that has bothered me for the longest while, yes, I messed up that top line, um, is that I don't want all my work to have fine line work. Now, in the past, I've been straying away from it where I did some more abstract painting, in this style, of course, but uh, voided of line work. I do however feel that this painting lends itself beautifully to having very strong line work. So while we are creating this painting, why not let me tell you what it's about. So usually I don't like explaining paintings to people, but I do feel that this piece does have some symbolism to it and that there is some things that would be easier to understand if I explain them. So this painting is titled The Lazy Priest and it's a commentary on how I feel about uh, religion nowadays. Being raised quite strictly Christian, I always had a lot of questions, um, a lot of things that didn't make sense to me at, the point, at some time of my life. And one of them were that I would always realize that a lot of the priests, especially local priests and international, um, it felt like they were in it more for the money than for the message. Now this painting is a commentary on that. It's saying that I feel that the, the preaching comes secondary to the financial gain that, it, that a preacher has. Now you'll see at the back, I'm busy painting the saint symbol. Now the saint symbol typically represents um, an icon being sanctified, which means they're holy, they've got something powerful to them, uh, something spiritually powerful. They're usually a very good person. While in this painting, I made the saint symbol um, line work pretty much, and it almost looks like um, prison bars. Now, this is intentional because I wanted it to look like, yes, this person might, mate, 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 this person might be seen as a saint, but I feel that they should be restricted and they should be punished for um, their misconduct because I do see many, many churches just coining the money and not caring so much about the people's need for a higher power. Now, the painting is pretty much at its end. Um, I'm just finishing the little character I've explained in the past. The character is just a little um, signature that I have where the character is also viewing you as you are viewing the painting. Um, I really enjoyed this painting. I think it came out really, really nice. Um, uh, I think the message is quite clear. I think the colors pop beautifully. And yeah, let's just sign the painting. And hopefully this painting will be off to somebody quite, quite soon. Oh, look at that sexy individual. Oh, verkeer me of ek verskeer my. So yeah, let me show you some close-ups. Mm. Kan jy dit oor vertel? Baby. 
Oh, seduction at its finest. Yeah. So that is the painting. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do feel free to like and subscribe. Oh, God, it's great in one of my... Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Have a lovely day. Much love. And yeah, scoop to the poop. I'll see you soon. Thank <music> you.